Hey guys, it's me. So, I just wanted to tell you guys, I have some ways that you can spot a fake friend. So, let's get started. Let's go. So, if you know what a fake friend is, they would ask you for stuff, like money, and then they take your boyfriend. If they take your boyfriend, you smack them. Can that repeat back? Yes, it's a video. So what you do is, first, here's how to tell if you have a fake friend. Ah, I really hurt my finger and I think it's really bleeding, actually. So could you please lend me a band-aid or, some, or something? Well, I have a first aid kit, but it's... Empty. Oh, that's Sammy's band-aid Sorry. Box. It's kind of empty. How many you got in here? Okay, well, since this is empty, Put I'll your name on yours. I'll hand it back to you, and I'll go look for some band-aids or go to the nurse. Here you go. Thanks. That's what a fake friend would do. Here's what a real friend would do. Can you help? My finger's bleeding, and it really hurts. I mean, like... Need a band-aid? Sure. Look, my first aid kit is full. It can give you a band-aid. Spick and span, and you'll be all better. Thank you. There we go. Thank you. Here's it back. Got it. Thank you. No, I should be thanking you. Have a fun day. You too. That's what a real friend would do. So yeah, basically. Here's, an here's another scenario in which a fake friend would do. I didn't have any lunch money. Can I have some Sour Patch Kids? Uh, sorry, but they're all empty. Yeah, all empty, I just checked. Yeah, they're all empty. Oh, okay, bye. A fake friend would leave all the candy to themselves and not just give it to you. Let's have some adopt me options. I mean, like, look, this is full. It has bags of it, so you can just give her one bag. Real friend, fake friend, fake friend, real friend. Next one. An adopt me scenario. I just got scammed. Really? What for? My neon twilight unicorn. I got a stupid owl. Oh, really? That's my dream pet. Can I have it? What's to offer? Golden unicorn. Okay. Okay, I'll send you a trade. Decline. Why'd you decline it? Well, because I don't accept trade requests. You have to. I have to send you one. But my mom said I can accept trade requests. Well, then, too bad. Have a good day. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. I'll turn my trades in, just for a second. Good. Send me trade? Okay. You first, though. You gotta send me it. You, well, I'm gonna send you the trade, but you have to go first, so that I make sure that I can trust you. Did you want one? I feel like you're scamming me, but okay. <laughs> well, I actually have it on my alt account. Uh, it should get to you by tomorrow. Bye. What? She left? Oh, I got scammed. I'm reporting her user. she gets bit. That's in which you would get scammed by your friend a million times. My best friend actually might be a fake friend. She has, I'll leave the pets in the description. If you have them, then please comment. My own best friend stole them from me and changed the name of the pets and lied to me. She scammed me for my pet and now she shows it off to me like it's not even mine. 
spam and have some pets. And then she's like, oh, it disappeared from my inventory. Sorry. Yeah, and then she talks about it with her pet, which is her. So then she takes my cho ride chocolate Labrador, names it Cupcake. What type of name is that? And then, like, when my dog dies, I wanted that to be the memorial of her. That dog meant so much to me. I was, like, trading it to her so that she would trade it to my other account. Because I didn't have two devices to do it on. She just scammed me. So you gotta watch out. I'm gonna type the pets in the description so that if you guys have them, please, you don't have to give them to me. I would trade my whole inventory except for the pets that are not for trade because she tried to scam me for some pets and now I value them more than anything. I only have one fly ride neon pit now. Oh, have a good day. Bye, guys.